Olá e sejam bem-vindos a mais o Pé Responde. Pé Responde feliz, Pé Responde com 2 a 0 na semana. Não tô feliz que o Ivoy não conseguiu o Penta, mas então seguimos. Você puxa a minha dança. Então, let's start with a question for Kaka, our leader, our captain, our general. Do you think that our bowling communication is getting better because of product calls? For me, this is yes. I think so. Tem que comparar, né? Tu é o único que pode comparar com como era com o Demet, como é com o Prodelta. Esse é o assunto? Ah, they are just asking if. I think I think since Prodelta joined the team, if our bot communication like got better or like at least for you. I don't know much because I don't remember well, like when I when I was with Demet. But for me, Prodelta is getting more confidence, so he's making better calls and. He's helping on my game too, so for me, it's good. I don't know, it's good. Actually, yesterday in, in interview, Pro Delta said that Bivoy asked you guys to when you guys are communication between you, mm. you, you two, you guys should speak Portuguese and yeah. like his AD, he just follow. I think he, <coughs> we tried sometimes. Não sei se você percebeu. Sim, sim. Uh, sometimes can help at first, like yeah. sometimes you don't need to know everything, you know. You just need to follow. Because normally. Me or Prodelta have the engage, so you can talk in Portuguese and Prodelta and Vivo just follow. Yeah, it's good to talk specifically details, right? In yeah, Portuguese. Of course. But sometimes if Vivo is playing various, he we should say English, you know? Yeah, because he can open fire. And since you are talking so much about communication, they are asking if you, Prodelta, if you had any like hard moments in the beginning speaking English with Vivo. Yes, no. Yes, no. Yes, né? Yes, né? Tá explicado já o porquê. <risos> My English is not good now, but it's okay. For me, the big problem is talk, because I can understand. For me, it's more easy to understand, but for talk, it's kind of more hard. Ah, ótimo. Importante entender, yeah. right? É que você fica com vergonha, né? Que coisinha linda. Papai. <risos> What you guys thinking about our new communication system they're saying, like? Now that our communication is better, and what are the expectations regarding our our change of style? Because now they are saying we are playing better in the early games. For sure, our communi communication is getting better because we got punished. Yeah, got punished. We're trying, <laughs> we're trying to to fix this, right? So actually, in the last Spain response, I think we complained about yeah, communication. We complained. Yeah, that's why we are talking too much. We are yeah. too much hurry. Why much fees, man? Hurry, hurry, hurry. So let's let's. Difficult, man. So you guys can see why our communication is hard. So you guys. Fala em português. É um ponto que eu até falei lá no Twitter para quem segue que não tava muito feliz. Para quem não segue lá no Carioca Calão. Não tava muito feliz com a nossa comunicação. Acho que foi um problema nos jogos contra Cabo e contra Laude. Tipo contra Cabo a gente ganhou mesmo assim, só que podia ter sido mais clean. Então algo que a gente está focando em melhorar. E eu sinto que a gente está tentando ter mais calma, a gente está tentando se ouvir mais, tentando não falar um em cima do outro e eu acho que com o tempo vai melhorando. E o que vocês pensam sobre o nosso mudança de estilo? Vocês pensam que estamos mudando o nosso estilo? Ou temos um jogo melhor early game agora? Eu não sei se estamos mudando o nosso estilo, mas com certeza estamos tentando adicionar mais coisas, sabe? Nós pensamos que nós deveríamos ter mais atividade, mais atividade no jogo, então é isso que estamos tentando ter, tentando melhorar. But we are not changing style, are we? I don't know. We are keeping our style and we are trying to add more things. That's why we are getting... I feel like we are getting better as a team because we have more things than less split. Perfect answer. Talking still about this early game situation, they are saying that in this weekend on Sunday we made the fastest game on Cibilo. You guys know, right? Mm -hmm. And it looks like for people that watch that we solved this our early game problem. And on the next Sunday we are gonna face Red and they didn't show good early games until now. So they want to know if you think the early game will be key, the key point against Red. I don't know if it's a key card because as they showed, even though they are behind, they know the way to come back most mm -hmm. of the times, mm -hmm. even though a lot of the times was more enemy mistakes also. So, But I feel like we are better as a team in the mid-late game. We have better setup for me, we have better Macros, so if we have better early game, we should be able to finish and we should be able to control the game. So I think every 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 part of the game is key card. <laughs> every time we should be playing well. So if we play well early game, I feel like we have a clearly advantage for the next uh, steps. So now they are saying congratulations for the weekend. Everyone played really well, especially Kaka on early game. 
and Prodelta with his mechanics. Wow. And they're asking like, he, in case we, we finish the second round in first. Mm. Who we choose? Yeah, who we will choose on playoffs. I remember that, I remember that, I remember that last beat, we got so touched <coughs> out because we chose red, remember? I remember yeah. Everybody was like, wow, you guys chose red. <laughs> ah, and we no chose goals. red. Yes. Yeah. 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 And since we won, nobody talked about that. <laughs> <laughs> well, true, it was 3-0 clean, right? Yes. No one trusted us. That's the case he totally, man. Depois que acabou o 3-0, tipo, né? Sim. Só passou. Sim. E se a gente tivesse perdido, a gente teria ouvido até hoje. Com certeza. Até hoje. Anyway, we are looking with this as play, so... It's kinda like... We should be able to beat anyone. Yeah. Can be anyone. Yeah. So we yeah. don't wanna <laughs> choose come. anyone, just come. <laughs> just, just come. come. And if we manage to, to, to be the first place, like... Uh, we will need to choose based on like our scrim results, or even yeah. like meta, or a lot of things that we will we'll still need to... To, to sit down and consider, you know? So now, the question is for our support. Dinkedo. <laughs> Pro Delta, what is the feeling to receive two MVPs on the same week? And on Saturday, four MVPs were for support. Four of the five MVPs were for support. Support meta. Yes, do you think it has something to do with the, with the meta nowadays or just coincidence? Uh, for me, it's really good. Uh, it's just this kind of consequence if I'm trying hard and playing well. I should just want to get more MVPs, use this for keep playing good, keep it focused, and keep it try hard. And about MVPs, I think yes, the meta is helping supports a lot now because it's more playmaking, you can make a good place. place. So it's kind of easy for you get more MVPs because you can just change the game with one game. And now for the last time ever, mm -hmm. because I'm tired of people talking about that, mm -hmm. what do you prefer? Play main support or play making support? É tanto fácil, pô. É completinho. É, o que vier não é jogo, pô. Mas pra escolher, eu escolhi o Tank. Escolhi o Tank? Acho que escolhi o Ele era Tank player. Eu só jogava de Tank antes. Eu jogava muito depois. Valeu, cara. Gravou? Foi. Since we are talking about Pro Delta and all of his MVPs, do you think it was unfair that you were not picked for the player of the week? Who was the player of the week? Jojo. Jojo? Tô perdido no bagote. Pô, os caras quiserem escolher ele, tem muito o que fazer, né? Na visão deles, os caras, ele jogou melhor. Se fosse mais bonito, quem você acha que ganha? Tu? Ó. And now, we have the next question for everyone. The big question. Watching the games, even though you guys win, like, easily and in a quick way, in the weekend, you guys still don't seem very satisfied and happy on stage, even with the victories. Why? For me, I think we didn't show like very much happiness still because we are only satisfied if we win. The CBLO, of course, we went to three finals in a row and like this beginning of the, this part of the split is not very like exciting for us, you know? So of course we are much, much more happy when we win, well, not when we win, when we play well, you know? So if we feel we didn't play the best we can, we are still not happy even, even, though, even though we win. So I think that's the strongest point and of course, like we just want to go to playoffs fast and we hope we are playing well on playoffs and we can win C below. Then you guys will see we are really happy. You know? yeah. True, true. I will be happy if I get him. <laughs> if I just need that, <laughs> this guy's like one kill, he's screaming at my head. <laughs> and it was like this since always, since always, since when he joined the team, he was already like this. So funny. And now they are asking, regardless of place and time, what was the most exciting moment in your career? Everyone. Of course, Pentakill. Of course, Pentakill. I guess loud. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't expect this. For me, of course, when I was champion, of course. For me, when I win academy. And for you, Vivas. My best moment, like, when I was JDG, I won against IG. IG was defending champion in the world. Mm -hmm. so I was really happy. That time I play like, with, like, this. Yeah. <laughs> really nervous. Yeah, that's yeah. good. Yeah. That's good, cool, actually. That's cool. When we won, of course, and we were together. We were together. The best sweep against Loud 2, MSI 2. Actually, MSI was really cool. You too, you too, you too. I said already, it was when we won and we went to MSI. And anyway, like when you're in international tournament, like 
learn a lot either from league or like from things outside you know you see how how small you can be in the world right you still have a lot of things to achieve a lot of countries to to go so it was like really inspiring moment for me it just made me want to go back again you know and to go back to an international stage again so yeah i think so msi was really cool so last question everybody's saying from the community i don't know if you guys saw if you go to finals we win against any team besides loud so <laughs> they are asking what why you think they, about that why they say that <laughs> you answer is it as i told yeah. <laughs> I have a really high expectation of this year. We will show that our victory this year. I think so yeah. that's all. True. We don't need to explain them, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, yeah, just what a cold guy, you know. Yeah. This is cold wise. For me, of course, we can't say we can't win against someone. If we say it like that, we are already give up on the, on the tournament. But I can understand why people think like that. But of course, we are not thinking. We think we can win everyone and we have high expectations in our scrim and our training nowadays so we feel we really different than the last split so of course we, we think we can win against everyone and we are doing our best to show them. E chegamos ao fim de mais um Responde. Ah. Muito obrigado a todos vocês que mandaram perguntas. A gente conta com o apoio e a torcida de todos vocês por mais esse um final de semana e vai ser bem legal em amanhã e domingo também tem jogão. E é isso. Tamo junto, é nóis. Tchau, tchau. Beijo. Tchau, tchau. tchau, tchau.